free kick is shanked sideways by Clough. Awkward, requires some clearing. Sean Fryer is still looming for the raw. Spins and feeds it to Gorry. This is again shooting range for Gorry. And she will accept the invitation to shoot. And Katrina Gorry scores. It proved to be an irresistible invitation for Katrina Gorry. And Newcastle are punished to full effect by the Matildas superstar. As we take another look here at the attempt, Lucy Johnson went sliding out of the way. Katrina Gorry beautifully inside the corner. Absolutely nothing that Georgina Worth could do about it. And I'm almost certain that that goal-scoring tribute running over to the sideline to grab the shirt was for Mariel Ecker, who went down with injury last week and is out for the rest of the season. But that strike is pure. And the Newcastle Jets... They knew what was coming. They couldn't do anything about it. They tried to defend it. Worth tried to keep goal, but it's Brisbane 1, Newcastle 0, and a moment of real quality from Katrina Gorey. So here's the resulting free kick, a bit further out than the last one. Still a good strike. Could cause trouble. It's being shown plenty of respect by a four-player wall. Agnew slides it through the right side. Griffith legged. Penalty shout, not given. Isabella Libri had a good view there through a sea of legs. And the Newcastle Jets players perhaps right to ask why. Here's Griffith on the ball, trying to make something happen again. Across over the right side of the area, Lauren Allen. Outside the box, Johnson with a long shot. It was a promising height, just wasn't on the target. And that's some signs of life in front of goal from the Newcastle Jets. And Lucy Johnson, who's never scored in this league, Gorry, an errant touch, and the door slightly ajar for Griffith. Here's the follow-up, and the shot is into the gloves of Hensley Handcuff. Such a tall, imposing figure. Made that look rather comfortable in the end. Davis. Newcastle stringing some passes together in advanced areas. Griffith, left-footed strike comes, and it's just over the bar. And that was much better from the Jets. One of the few times in this game that they've actually been connecting passes in their attacking third, and it instantly leads to a shot. Not on target, but just over from Sarah Griffith, and that's Brisbane on notice now. Ball falls in the box. Gorry, dangerous. Katrina Gorry got the angle spot on. There is one unstoppable force in this game, and her name is Katrina Gorry. Here's another look, Gorry, an unchecked run, able to take a touch. Taryn King went in with a slight challenge, couldn't impact the ball or the player, and Gorry, on an acute angle, nestled it in the corner. Here's another look at how Davis was able to pick the pocket of Shea Connors. Now on the turn, Griffith, last ditch challenge was crucial. Here's a shot on the spin, and it's over the bar. Why it took going 2 0 down for them to spark to life. Griffith was nearly away there, but that is great defensive midfield work from Ish Nori. Ball breaks into the middle, though. Maybe this is Newcastle's chance. Allen Johnson slides it low. Griffith with it all to do at the top of the box. And now the follow up shot comes in. Good save by Handcuff. And Rashad is first to respond, putting it behind for a corner. And that was Lauren Allen asking a big question of Hensley Handcuff. No one able to actually fire an effective shot crummer and this could be tamar levin's big moment here it's the youngster levin and a good save follow up gory clattered advantage given the ball is still live at the feet of crummer gory trying for a hat trick players falling out of the way it's all a bit chaotic palmer against johnson still holly palmer and now levin again gory is in an offside position and that shot is bending wide You've got to give credit to Worth for the save, though, because it was Tamar Levin. As we take another look at this chance here for Levin, it was a well-hit left-footed shot. Worth, in no man's land, it's safe to say, was able to get down and make the save. I think Gorry, I'm not sure advantage suited Brisbane there. Norrie didn't control it with any real conviction. And now charging through, here's Davis. Oh, just wide of the top right. Cass Davis has come with a mission today. I think she's sick of not having a goal to her name in this competition. Let's see what they can do. Here's the shot. 
and handcuff parries out for a corner. Might have been in two minds about a catch or the parry there, Hensley handcuff, but all's well that ends well. Kept it out of the back of the net. That was the most important thing. And still the clock continues to run here. The referee making the players do a bit of overtime at the end of the game. Griffith swings it to the far post. And what a chance for Kanyaski, but there was no power behind the touch. And Hensley handcuff had one last shot on target to save. And the clean sheet was maintained right up until the very last second. And Kanyaski, well, it was off the thigh rather than the boot. Gratefully grasped onto, and that is what Brisbane Raw have done to the three points as well. All over in Newcastle, and it's the Raw that prevail. Newcastle Jets nil, Brisbane Raw two.